I'm Mark Zeff from FounderOfOptionGroup.com, and this is the AM Dollar Credit Report. Reminder, this is for education purposes only. Never should be considered investment advice. Options have risk. Consult your financial professional. Well, we got an update on our hands today so far. Uh, Spoo's up about 10, so it's way through the 50-day moving average. You know, we, we talked about repeatedly about how um, – the S&P seemed unable to kind of break through that 50-day moving average. Well, now it has, uh, which means we're going to break higher, kind of the way everything's set up right now. All right. Now, VIX is now 1074, but what's what's interesting is take, take a look at uh, – take a look at VIX, 1074. For the VIX, great. Futures, the sub future is still twelve ninety five. I mean, that is uh, an insanely widespread, and it kind of shows you that people are still worried about a couple of things, notably North Korea. Uh, we got tax talk, we got Trump talk, but follow currently VIX futures are way overpriced. Uh, yeah, we got a Fed meeting, uh, but that's not worth 2.2 points, right? It's not worth that. Um, VIX futures should be about 12 right now, 12.20, about 75 cents too expensive. Um, so what does that mean? That means UVXY should probably be trading 28, not 30.22. And VXX should be seeing some downside pressure as well. I think there's tons of, of potential downside for those, those names. They're all way overpriced. Um, oil, catching a, a touch of a bid here. Up uh, USO up 20, and that's on uh, you know oil supply concerns. Um, that'll that'll get faded. Uh, Amazon off to the races. You can see um, NASDAQ was the performer yesterday between Amazon, Apple, Google, your Facebooks. I mean, that was where a lot of the market rally came from. Uh, seems to be where a touch of that is coming from today. Um, I would point out that uh, VIX Mo is still 11.4. So there, there's definitely some monthly stuff going on. Um you know, as I look around, I see some, you know, a little bit of upside in the financials today um, and really kind of across the board. The, the one thing that's interesting is bonds are up, too. So that's never a good sign. Stocks up, bonds up, always a, nerve, a nervous thing for me, uh, always makes me worry. Uh, and so that's something to think about. Uh, some stocks had earnings today. Dollar General had earnings today. Uh, did not go so well, and so did Campbell's Soup. Mm -mm, not so good for Campbell's Soup. Uh, so I'm going to look at those names, and then um, now that things have settled down a little bit, I'm going to look at EWY uh, to see if there's now a trade there since it's been a couple of days. All right, folks, if you have questions, you can email me, Mark at optionpit.com and call me 888-TRADE-01.